Hey everybody, here we are at the Habitat Restore. This Restore's hours are Monday through Saturday, 10 to 4, and I'll list their address in the description box below. And here's a shot around the store, and you know by now we're going to get into all the areas. And this item was sold, but all the more reason I just wanted to show you we need to shop our Habitat Restore several days a week. Oh, I really like these drawer pulls. You know we got to look at it. <laughs> And this restore had drastically reduced items the day I went, so this table, we had seen it in a few videos back, but they've got it marked down now to $125. And this is a marble top table. Oh, I love it. I love, love it. And y'all know I love the dishes. I love all the dishes. So this is a 48-piece set of Poppy Trails Dahlia dishes for $168. Oh, I love that. I, I love the color. I love the dahlias on it definitely gives me a bohemian vibe and these are made in california and here's an outdoor adirondack chair for 15 dollars Here's a set of bar stools for $30 each. The upholstery felt like leather. They look brand new. And this particular restore has a silent auction, so we've got to go through and see what they've got. Number 11 is a Burke County collection, and there's an old yearbook in here. It's called Cat's Tale. Who out there still has their high school yearbook? And number 10 is an original Mack truck bulldog hood ornament. I love that. Number 9 is vintage plush toys, DC Super Friends, Superman, and Paddington Bear. Number 8 is a vintage Tonka Bell system truck. Number 7 is a vintage Coleman water jug with a cigarette emblem on it. Number 6 is a Cabbage Patch Kid from 1982. And number 5 is a Campbell Soup Collection. I love those mugs. And number four is a Princess House lead crystal lamp. Number three is a Kitchen Pots collection with a cast iron skillet and a cornbread skillet. Number two is a Vintage Book collection. It's got the Ancient Mariner in it. And number one is a Peanuts collection. It's got a giant Snoopy Pez dispenser still in the box. And it's got the Peanuts lunch bag cookbook circa 1970. Oh, I'd love to have that. And number 12 is a quilt. Someone has already bid $50 on this quilt. Number 13 is two gumball machines. And the green one down below is listed as vintage. And believe it or not, someone has already bid $200 on this pair of gumball machines. Who remembers begging for money for the gumball machine when you were a kid? I remember that, oh my goodness. <laughs> they set it up front, it was just too tempting. And number 14 is an old hay rake. Who out there remembers those? So I hope y'all are having fun going with me for these walkthroughs. And I wanted y'all to see this sectional. So it's a little over $200. I think it's in good condition. You know I love that gray color. And they had several antique items here today. This is a sideboard for $175. And it had these papers that look and felt like they were stuck to it. So y'all will have to let me know. Is that something that could easily be remedied? Look at the detail carving on the legs. And I love that older furniture had like the tiny little wheels on the front legs of it. And here's a piece to match it for $250. I love these older hutches. I love that they're smaller, a little more compact. 
it does have a little wear on the inside of it, but you know, that would be fun to maybe take a doily and put in it. Nobody would ever see it. And here's the sideboard to match at $285. It's unusual that I find a complete set of matching antique pieces like this. Here's a set of three marble top tables for $150. I like the carving on the drawer. And look at the harp pedestal. I'm actually trying to climb out of this bed <laughs> to show you all this. Oh, I'm such a mess. And here's a rocking chair for $45. And I think these will be perfect in a baby's room. Definitely check your restore for home decor items. Here's a centerpiece tea light for $5. And I said, this looked like the offering plate at my church. <laughs> and they said, oh, we should pass it around here. So they've got it labeled as a plant stand for $25. And y'all know I love the basket. So this one's $12. I think that'd be pretty hanging with a fern on it. And this is one of their items that's waiting to be priced. You can't buy it today. You've got to come back tomorrow to see what the price is. They kind of entice you to come back and shop again. I think this is everything. Y'all know I love to look at the beds. And I love this basket. Oh, I should have bought this basket. So this I think would be perfect on your porch with some red geraniums in it. And they always have the best deals on their lamps. These are $12 a piece. And I really like this full size bed for $65. And you know, if you don't like the color, this would be a perfect DIY to do a chalk paint on. Here's a set of four heritage dessert dishes, $16. Oh, and I like the etching on it. And it gets even better. These are actually Princess House pieces made in France. And this one really caught my eye. I love the finial on top. I just love the cut glass on it. $3. That'd be perfect on your desk as a candy dish. And I'm running across the best cups and mugs at the ReStore. These are a dollar a piece. Look at that design. That would be so pretty for a cocoa bar or a coffee bar. Oh, I like the blue one. I think I'll, that's my favorite. Oh, I like the red too. Can I have two favorites? <laughs> And these are candle sconces from Party Light. They're $3 a piece. Okay, so for my regular viewers, y'all know what we're going to do with this box. If you're new to my channel, we're always looking for a place to hide our secret papers. I love just the zebra print on it. I think it'd be perfect. And I had to show you these mugs. They're so adorable. So a dollar, the little panda mug. And look at this. I've never been in a Starbucks ever in my life. A dollar fifty. People tell me it's fabulous. And oh, this one, I think just the hippie in my soul. I love this little Volkswagen bus. A dollar. Isn't that the cutest mug you've ever seen? And I just wanted to show you all this. I thought it was so cute. You could create your own gifts and centerpieces. And since we saw those little gumball machines, I thought this was perfect to tie it in. So this is how you'd make your own little candy gumball machine. Wouldn't that be a fun little gift for somebody's birthday or maybe for a kid's party?
Oh, and I love the cookies, especially the chocolate chunk cookies. So, you know, we have to take a look at that recipe. And I've stopped the video if you want to stop and write the recipe down. And gosh, I really wish you'd just make me these cookies. <laughs> that would save me a lot of trouble having to make them for myself. And I found this beautiful cookbook. It says, Victoria, at table with family and friends, treasured recipes for memorable meals. And I found a recipe for apricot butter. I've never tried that, but I thought I might. And look at this, brand new in the box from Kirkland's. Here's a clock for $12.50. Okay, this was hands down my favorite find at the ReStore here today. So they've got it labeled as a pot rack. It's metal. It's $35. I think I would take this, put it behind a bed, and hang curtains from it where it looks like a crown over the back side of your bed. Isn't that beautiful? Okay, here's another gift for your friend who has everything. It's $6.50. It looks like a really big butterfly on the straw bag. I like the bag. I'm not sure about the butterfly. And I thought this was so adorable. It's one of those items that was sold, but it's a little kid's table and chair set. And y'all, we had to take another look at it. This is still here. I can't believe it. It's that Beacon Hill Collection Vanity. I looked Beacon Hill up online in my last video. These go for thousands and thousands of dollars. And here's a Circle of Friends piece of clay pottery. And you can put a candle in the center of it. It's $22. And this is probably the funniest thing I've seen at the ReStore. So it's a jiu-jitsu offense and defense book for 25 cents. And it's older. And it's given us some pointers. So here we go. It says, this is the dirty blackout trick. Remember it and guard yourself accordingly. And don't get excited when attacked from the rear, but grasp arms firmly and act. And this says, put the light to your back and come out fighting. So here we are. We're getting ready. We're going to come out fighting. And then it says, deception can be used in many ways. This you can develop in your own way. So he's pointing one direction and then he's punching in the other. So he's like, hey, look here. <laughs> and then it says, this is an emergency measure, but it has authority. So if nothing works, just give him the bite. <laughs> I'm telling you, I was standing there laughing so hard at that book. But definitely check your ReStore for books. Any of these books on this table would be a perfect coffee table book. And you know, you're not going to pay much money, I think a couple of dollars. And this book caught my eye. This is from Sir Lawrence Alma Tadema, and he was a famous painter in the Victorian era. And I just thought these were so pretty. These would be perfect to take and actually cut out and mat and frame. And I'm always running across books like this at the ReStore. Aren't those dreamy? And here's a large vintage wooden and metal tray for $20. Oh, that's so pretty around the edge. I think that'd be perfect again behind your wine bar in your kitchen. And I turned around and saw this green velvet chase lounger for $90. Now the velvet does have some wear on it, but oh, talk about a statement piece and I think that'd be perfect if you do photography as just a little seating prop and I'm running across these older sewing machines they've got this one with the cabinet price for $80 This one's in good condition. I really like the carving detail on the front. And what is it with me and this Eiffel Tower business? I'm telling you, I'm gonna make it to Paris one day. This lamp's only $10. And I was really drawn to this light wood cabinet. It's $175. 
I think this is in fabulous condition and that's a fantastic deal for this piece. And definitely check your ReStore for artwork. This is a large print. I love the frame around it. It's $18.50. Okay, I want y'all to hear me out on this. These are only $5 a piece. They're metal bar stools. The seat cushions do need to be replaced, but you know what? For the money you're saving, you could easily do that. And this was sold but I had to tell you this is such a throwback my grandmother my other grandmother had one of these on her front porch I love to go visit her just so I could sit in her rocker glider oh, that took me back and I really like this metal corner cabinet it's another one of those items waiting to be prized oh isn't that pretty you know I love that swirly metal again it's a space saver I love the compact size of it Okay, we're back at that chain. I'm going across it. I'm not supposed to go back there, but you know what? I'm doing it. <laughs> I'm doing it for us. I got to hurry back there because they don't want anybody behind the chain. This is an item they don't have priced yet. Oh, isn't that pretty? That's just everything. I love the color of it. I love all the ornate carvings. And just know when you shop your Habitat Restore, you're helping someone else with home ownership. And here's another example of that markdown. We saw this chair last week for $85. They've deeply discounted it, 20 bucks. And another shout out to my hubby, you float my boat. <laughs> Does anybody even say that now? And I turned around and I saw these two pictures, $12.50 a piece. I love the color. I, look at the frame. That's beautiful. Oh, and I hope you can see that's actually kind of a bluish color on the mat. And you know I love the pillows at the ReStore. These are only $5 a piece. And I thought these were adorable. So it's gallery wrap canvases, $6.50 a piece. I think it'd be perfect in the baby's room. I wanted to show you all this. So it says vintage records in an album, Victor Records, 1895 to 1904. There's six records in here and it's got Nipper Dog on the canvas. They've got this whole book for $25. So you know we've got to take a look at it. And it looked like in looking through these that it's all like uh, big band music. I think there was actually a military orchestra. And the story goes that two young farmers with their newly engaged servants arrive at the farmhouse. The ladies for a lark went to the Richmond Fair dressed as servants, found themselves in a serious predicament when they accepted a shilling from the farmers, thereby legally bonding themselves to service for a year. And then just the story goes on from there. So it sounds like maybe it was a play on the record. You guys will have to let me know below if you've heard of any of these. Oh, and there's one, what does it say? A waltz. And then this one is actually from a military band, Chimes of Normandy. So I hope y'all had fun going with me to the ReStore. I love taking you along with me for these walkthroughs. And I wanted to showcase this sign I found. It says, live the life you've always imagined. And that is my challenge to you today. Whatever it is, whatever your dreams are, I want you to go for it today. Make today the day. So thank y'all so much. I hope everyone has a wonderful day. And until next time, come go with me today. Bye.